good evening friends time for the trade review uh, for 2nd of december 2020 today for some reason investing is not working and it does not work most of the time so i am trying out this uh, trading view package looks nice for starters and uh, for some reason it is giving me all these moving averages and uh, i don't need so many so let me see if i can remove some of them and uh, maybe change 200 Okay, so now we have 20, 30, and 200. Now, uh, when we get uh, SMP 500 here, Currently, I think I need to type SPX 40. Now, SP 500 this morning opened uh, lower, it gapped down into its 200. And as you can see, 200 works in all markets. And since that time, uh, the index has only recovered and gone up almost into the green so for the moment uh, global markets look fine now uh, let me give you my take on what is going on on one hand we have nifty which has made these couple of hanging man patterns and almost taking out uh, this sort of uh, You know, bearish engulfing that we had uh, made here. So almost uh, maybe as soon as tomorrow, we could be breaking out of this. And uh, now this other interesting bit is that FIS today bought only Three fifty crores, and because of that, the bank Nifty came down. Now my sense is that, uh, given global markets, etc., uh, today could be a one-off, and if uh, Nifty gaps up into fresh highs, the bank Nifty will also see a very sharp short covering. So for tomorrow. I would think that if you get any sort of uh, movement towards the low and then the bank nifty comes back, you are likely to see a strong upside. So this is the view I want to take on the bank nifty. You put a stop below this and you carry, we have carried our long positions on bank nifty for the 10th of december uh, 30000 calls so what i think has happened is that uh, some sort of catapult action is happening where bank nifty has gone down and uh, you know once it recovers it will come back very strongly and uh, what do you do on the nifty on the nifty basically uh, the pivot for tomorrow i have them marked out 
things about uh, Thirteen thousand seventy-five, and uh, I would expect targets closer to thirteen two one eight. Uh, once we are beyond uh, this thirteen one sixty-five, these are all cash levels. So let's have a look at a couple of charts which I gave as uh, swing calls today. you can see here sbi live what we have here is uh, some sort of head and shoulder which is forming here and beyond this i think targets of 960 are possible on sbi live before we discuss other stocks uh, let me inform you that uh, our youtube join buttons are functional and uh, you get daily guidance on those uh, on that platform on individual stocks on the indices there are three types of services silver gold diamond and you can choose what suits you best plus we have the recorded webinars which are going like hot cakes and we had not expected this sort of response so they are available for 2000 plus gst and we also have a live webinar planned Uh, on the 19th of december now lots of people say what is the difference between live and recorded well live is live in concert and recorded is a you know as they used to have in earlier times cassette or cd a recording is a recording so uh, whoever wants to come live And twenty thousand is not that big of a price, given that you get some amount of practical training also included in that. So that should uh, be taken by uh, people. And uh, if you have questions, WhatsApp nine eight seven one zero double six double three seven, or email Ashwini underscore Gujral at yahoo dot com. E S H W A N I underscore G U J R A L at yahoo dot com. So now let's uh, discuss other uh, stocks that uh, again. So S B I Life we have discussed. Another one. i want to discuss uh, and it it's valid even for tomorrow is uh, pd light this is pd light so again you can see and n pattern which is forming and this we had discussed in our webinar this has large implication so possibly targets of 1850 uh, seem likely here so both these calls were given in our join button services and uh, let's see what else Thirty thousand, ten December calls need to be carried. So we are carrying them. And let's uh, hope that the market is planning to do what I think, which is that this is a mild correction. One thing I would like to uh, tell you guys is 
there are some similarities in what happened in march where you had these uh, you know three peaks one two three and then you had a collapse in the afternoon it appeared to me that maybe a similar pattern is forming on the nifty index like here but you see all of this is subject to confirmation if there is no confirmation then you know these sort of patterns are often visible and they don't mean a whole lot so for the moment uh, we just keep this in mind this shows that there is a slowing of momentum at these levels but if there is enough money momentum can pick up again as well so tomorrow is a fairly key uh, day because we had a bit of weakness on bank nifty today but if the nifty starts to break out then you know it will be difficult to hold back the bank nifty and often what bank nifty does is it pulls back and then it rockets up because you know it is a higher beta index so let's see what the bank nifty has in mind because it clearly appears that nifty possibly is likely to go towards new highs that should be it for this review take care trade well and please consult your financial advisor